My name is Craig Hamilton from Remax Eastern Realty in Lakefield, Ontario. I'm a broker there and um, I want to welcome you to our video series giving short explanations of common real estate questions um, that we typically get from buyers and sellers. Um, as a seller, one thing that we will be asking you to fill out as part of the listing package is called the Seller Property Information Statement. And I've brought along copies of these and we'll have copies posted on to the, the website. This is the Seller Property Information Statement. It is basically 30 to 40 questions, common questions about the major mechanical, structural and environmental components of your cottage, home or just your vacant property. Um, along with the SPIS is another what's called the Water Waste Disposal access and shoreline schedule. Again, this is posted on the website so you can read through the questions yourself. Um, the SPIS and the water schedule are basically simple questions. They ask for a yes, no, unknown or not applicable answer. You just initial in the appropriate box and then for questions that require a more detailed answer there's a section at the end where you can give an explanation, maybe the age of your septic system, the age of your roof covering, uh, type of wiring, any improvements that you've done that aren't necessarily detailed in the initial question. Um, as with any form that we ask you to sign, it is a good idea to maybe check with your lawyer, um, get his opinion on the legalities around the SPIS and the water schedule. Again, if you answer honestly, if you answer to the best of your knowledge and do your best to, to give up the answers as you would expect to get them from someone else, you shouldn't have any problem with answering all the questions on these forms.